Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the introduction of bookkeeping and we will also discuss about the types of accounts guys. Okay, so initially let us go through what is this bookkeeping. So bookkeeping is nothing but this is the first stage of accounting guys in which you will be writing all the records in a small book or in a performer. Fine. So bookkeeping is the first stage of accounting which mainly deals with the recording of all financial transactions of the business. So all the transactions which you are doing will be stored in this bookkeeping. Okay. So what are the main objectives of this bookkeeping guys? So the objectives of bookkeeping are almost similar to accounting guys. So in accounting we have discussed that we will be storing all those things right. So basically in accounting you will be storing them and you will be calculating many many things guys. Like what is the profit, how much you spend and everything like that fine. So here in bookkeeping we maintain all the records for a given period to serve as a permanent reference in future. So you will be taking a book and you will be writing in this date I collected this much money from this guy. The amount is this and I have given him in this way. Like that you will be defining everything guys. So to know the result of the business over a particular period of time. To know the financial position of the business at a point of time. So these could be the few objectives of bookkeeping guys. So now let us go through some differences basically of bookkeeping and accountancy. So basically there are no, no much differences guys. I just written some points about those things. So bookkeeping. Bookkeeping is nothing but recording financial transactions, posting debits and credits, producing invoices, complete payrolls and maintaining and balancing ledgers and accounting accounts fine whereas accounting is nothing but preparing and adjusting the entity entries and preparing financial statements analyzing the operation cost complete income and tax returns are available in accounting and helps the company to understand the impact of financial action fine so i hope everyone got a small idea basically these are points guys there are no much differences between bookkeeping and accounting so now let us go through some types of accounts guys. So basically we are having three different types of accounts guys in which we will be using the real time account in our all problems, most of the problems basically. Okay. So personal account. Personal account is nothing but account belongs to a person or a company or an organization. So please remember this is a small formula guys. Debit the receiver and credit the giver. Guys we will be using this. Please remember it. So real account. So the second type account will be real account. So real account is nothing but it stores the purchases, returns, the sales and cash. We will be using in most of the problems we'll be using this real time account and in few problems we'll be using this personal account guys. Okay. So here the formula is debit what comes in, credit what goes out. Please remember this guys. This is really, really important while solving your problems. Okay. So now let us go through nominal account. So nominal account is nothing but all expenses, losses, gains and profits. We'll be storing in this nominal account. So the format will be debit all expenses and losses and credit all gains and profits. Fine. So these are the types of accounts and in, in this lecture itself we have discussed about bookkeeping and all those things. So in the next lecture we'll be starting with our first topic that is nothing but journal entries. So how you'll be entering the daily activities that has just happened in your company. So let us meet in the next tutorial with this particular topic. Thank you. Thanks for watching.